Hey everyone, thanks for coming back to the BNS channel. My name is Edie Ann, I'm an independent Sensi consultant. We're in a new place. Um, and that's kind of what I wanna to talk to you guys about today. So I have been with Sensi for about 12 years. And one of the beautiful things that I have gotten really spoiled with is the fact that I can do it from anywhere. So let me share a little bit of a story. I, two years ago, I, is it two years? Might have been even three years at this point. I decided that I wanted to open up a mini restaurant, like a snack bar, um, like a walk up window kind of thing, like a Dairy Queen mini version. And so it had always been kind of a dream of mine to do that, to have a restaurant of sorts to be able to provide um, food service and have the ability to um, give a place for my community to go. Uh, it was great. It was great. Um, it didn't work out for other reasons, but there were a few things that I learned in the process. I was tied down, like really tied down. I had to be there every day. I had to be around if I wasn't there every day. Finding employees was um, tending to be very difficult, um, good employees. It was very demanding on my time, on my space, uh, where I could go and where I couldn't go. Uh, my husband and I have a motorcycle and couldn't even go for rides on motorcycle because I had to be around. So, and, and because it was such a small restaurant, I really needed to work it in order to make any money at it. So it became very daunting. Um, even my family uh, struggled with the fact that they couldn't see Nana all the time or whenever they wanted. Um, and so understanding also that I had already been doing Sensi. And so that lifestyle that I had created with Sensi was already established in my life. And then I plopped this restaurant in the middle of it and it shifted everything. Um, and so that life of being spoiled to my own time was gone. Um, and so when whenever we decided that we needed to close the restaurant, um, I was able to go back to my life, my sensi life. <clears throat> and I'll tell you that it was incredible to feel the relief and to feel now understand that restaurant business is very demanding anyway. I mean, that's probably one of the most demanding careers that somebody could, cho could choose. Um, but I really, really felt the relief of stress and just of that corporate life, right? And even before that, before when I first started Sensi, I was a, a pharmacy technician. And so the demand of having to go to work every day, doing a nine to five ish, sometimes more um, because of overtime, it was just a relief to be able to go back to my Sensi life. And so what I want to share with you guys today is just the fact that when you own your own business, that is one thing. There is some freedom that comes with owning your own business, but I owned that restaurant. There wasn't a lot of freedom there. I guess it's the kind of business that you choose to be participating in. Now, listen, I'm not telling you not to chase your dreams. I'm not telling you not to try things. Um, but I want to share that I've been there, done that. And I know that for me, Sensi has been a godsend. It's been a way for me to make money, to travel, 
to make my own hours. Um, and I guess it comes to why I'm here in this little cottage today. So I'm in a one room cottage, been here for about a month. Um, it'll be a month next week. And I've been able to work my business from here. Like I'm near my grandchildren. I'm near my children. I get to enjoy that part, you know, being part of their lives for a short time. And I get to work my business from here. I mean, my slippers are there, my bed's here, my desk is here, the kitchen's over here. It's a small room, but I love it because I can do my business from here. Like as long as I have a phone, as long as, and I brought my, I have a laptop, um, you know, I just, it's wonderful. And it's such an amazing type of life that I would be super selfish to not share that knowledge with everyone um, to give you the opportunity to try it yourself, right? And I, this is the way I feel. It cannot hurt to try. The kit is $99 to join, right? And so like any business, I had to invest a lot of money to start that restaurant. I had to pay a lot of monthly bills to run that restaurant, whether it was the food or the utilities or the employees. There was a lot of money that had to be invested for that business to run. The only investment that I've had to make with Sensi to get it started was that $99 kit. And that basically just allows you to get a little bit of product, get a little bit of administrative things like the order forms and the catalogs, selling tools, right? Things that you're going to need to run your business, um, including a free website for three months and then you pay $15 a month. Now, if all I had had to pay was $15 a month for my restaurant, who knows, it might still be open today. Probably not. But I know that the minimum amount that you have to invest in for this business is so worth it because it's not a lot and it cannot hurt to try. So my feelings are if you're looking for a side gig, if you want something to do on the side of what you're already doing, then try it. Maybe you're looking for a career of your own, something that you can call your own. Maybe you're just needing to get out there and, um, you know, try something of your own. It cannot hurt to try. And that's kind of the message that I want to give you guys today. It can't hurt to try. If, what if, listen, what if it fails? If it fails, then you've got more than $99 worth of product that you can personally use. But what if it doesn't fail? Like what if something takes off and you're sitting here in a cottage like me near your kids for a month at a time, working your business, building a team, building a career for yourself, making money, traveling the world, who knows, right? I just feel like it can't hurt to try, right? It can't hurt to try and ride a bike because the exhilarating feeling that you get from actually riding a bike could make the difference for you. It can't hurt to um, try tying your shoes because maybe now you're not gonna trip anymore. You get what I'm saying. It cannot hurt to try. And so I'm inviting you to do that. If you would like to do that, let me know, I can help you. Um, I have lots of systems in place that can help you get set up and going in your business. I'm here to help you, that's what I do. Love teaching, love coaching. Um, I just, I love what I do and I wanna share that with you. Wow, that rhymed and I did not expect it to do that. <laughs> Guys, listen, if you have a little faith I think that's backwards for you. Faith makes everything possible. Um, if you have a little faith, it cannot hurt to try things, right? Hope can bring a lot of wonderful things in your life. So let me know if it's something that you're interested in. I would love to help you get started. And um, yeah, from my little cottage here. I hope you guys have an amazing day and hopefully I'll talk to some of you soon. Bye.